tell them the story? Yeah, and all of a sudden, we, we said, I see these young Marines, and I always tell this story about uh, our lieutenant. He always says, well, what we hit? Uh, you guys could hit the side of a barn. Oh, what we hit? Oh, you always hit two Japanese hoop houses. <laughs> and they were laughing like anything. <laughs> But it was true, because we never knew what we had, you know. When you were firing, you mean? Yeah, well, we were seven miles away. We could be seven miles with our guns, you know. And when we moved up to another position, then we could see what we could do, you know. This was before you landed? No, no, when, on, on, like when you were on Iwo or, or Saipan or Tinny. Tinny on the Iwo, we only stayed in one position. Because we could reach but the island was only five miles. I mean, yeah, five miles long, three miles wide. And but so, but you were you were like you were on the uh, you had like dug in there. Yeah. Yeah. Yes, so. I been, yeah, and on Evo we didn't move. We just landed by the first airfield because uh, we were right in the middle, and then we could fire either way, you know. Were you were you just firing blindly, or were you? No, no, we, no. We had the fire direction sign, and they would tell you where to fire. You know, and uh, the only and thing about Evo, there was one place you could land, and they knew it. Right. <laughs> on Evo, the only place you could land was on the beach you could land. On. Yeah, right. They knew that. They, the other place you yeah. couldn't get in. But know, we didn't uh, move. Oh, yeah. the artillery, we just stayed there. Yeah. I got to run out of weight because we lost ten ten ducks going in there. Out of 12 before the catch. And the irony of it, damn thing, you couldn't believe it that uh, I, uh, my son got the book on Paribo, and the 4th Battalion, 14th Marines, only lost, lost three guys. Yeah, one, one was killed on the LST before the, you know, they hit the LST, and two were hit, and two kids that I was in a park show with the night before, they dropped the water in the next day. But, and that's the only three guys who were killed on here. I couldn't believe it until I got this. The, the only three in your unit? In, in, in our unit. Really? The Fort wow. Marine, Fort, Fort, 14th Marines, 4th Battalion, K Battery. Um, it was unbelievable. How's any amphibians? They took you guys in, amphibians. Oh, yeah? No TVs? No, no he didn't take me in. They had to call it off at the army. What's that? Uh, they brought us in on E1 ducks. Oh, yeah, but we had the amphibians. Yeah, yeah, no, we had ducks. Yeah, and that was the first time we uh, we had the black guys on the, uh, you know, that were army. And the funny thing, I was talking to one of them, and he says, they were training 17 months on, uh, on Oahu. This is the first time they were allowed to go into combat. It was the 27th? Uh, 27th Army Division? Uh, I don't know what it was, really. Yeah, they were with us. Was that what But the, that was on uh, Saipan. No, no, this was on Iwo. No. Saipan, we had the regular regular Army. Uh, Na I mean, Marine Corps. Marine, that's what I say. Yeah. Yeah. All the Marines were on Saipan. Yeah. All right. Iwo. Yeah. You you were you were amphibious on Iwo. Yeah. Yeah. So. Tractors that you see coming up out of the water. Yeah. But well, and, the, and then where you you landed then after after him or were you were uh, the well, first? We landed the first day we tried to go in and uh, when the duck sunk. The second day uh, we went in the second day. Yeah, and then uh, only two made the beach out of out of twelve. Uh, out of, uh, out were, of were eleven. you like just waiting in the water? To, uh, no, we were waiting on a boat chip. Oh, I see. The LST. I LST, see. I see. The LST, the Wildoors, all came all the way up on the shore. That's after after the first three, three or four waves. After three or four waves went in. Yeah, I and see. They, they probably start bringing LSTs in where they could. Yeah. And they got us almost all the way back to the beach that first day. I was on the first wave. I know. <laughs> what was it like to hit the beach there? <laughs> well, we were supposed to go all the way up to the first airport. Didn't make it. That's where we stayed we when we came in the second day, right below the first airport. Right. But that second day, you already had that airport. Right. Yes. That yes. That's the high. And Mount Sir Watch is on your left way up. Could you see it? Yeah. yeah. You, you saw I it. I saw okay. the flag. Really. No kidding. You actually saw them raise it. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. It was a yeah. real still, and all of a sudden a shout went up when everybody saw this. Like, this is me talking because you're the Marines over there. Yeah. Yeah. Where is it? I kind of hate it. Did you see the flag go up, Jack? No. I had my back to it and I heard this roar. And I turned around and there was a flag raised. I got one here. Do they pop out? I got the 
the island was two and a half miles wide in the narrowest place. Yeah. Six and a half miles long. Was like it a four five? Shop. Yeah. Was it five? I thought it was five. Six. I said I heard it was five. Yeah. You always? Yeah. 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 Five and three. Five and three boys. Yeah. I'd like the Mount Union, the Joe Buck from Oklahoma, went back for the 25th anniversary on the Yeah. And he went back for the 50th. Oh, yeah. I didn't even know they were taking them. Yeah, I didn't either. And then uh, I wanted to show you this one. So, wow. Where the heck did that go? Did the flag stay up long? That's how long was the flag the up long? How long was the flag up there? First time he went down shortly. I'm sorry? Yeah. First no, time the they price put it up, it went down. came down. Yeah. Then they put it up the second time and it stayed up. This is what Sarabachi looks like now. Oh, yeah. You what happened there. was that they raised the first flag. So that when they, some uh, general or whoever, Aris is trying to know, what do you got, a postage stamp up there? This is the second right. time you went there? Yeah. yeah. That's on the 25th my, anniversary or the 50th? No, right now. Right now. This, this oh, March. Yeah, so the, the other guy that just made the speech there, yeah. he was in charge of that. And then what happened was somebody gave him another flag. So this guy rose it because there was a Marine Firefighter had taken a picture of the guy. So there was a Marine for, uh, what was he? Joe Rosen. It was a newspaper report. Yeah, but I can't. Rosenthal, yeah. Joe Rosenthal. And, yeah. And then he said, uh, do you mind if I go up with this? So this is why not. That wasn't Rosenthal, was it? Yeah. He took the second picture. So anyway, when he went up there, he never knew he took that picture, you know. So, yeah. So what had happened after he took the first picture, he, he uh, had some guys and they, they posed, the guy, there were about, what, about 12 of them that posed for the second picture. So when he didn't know about the first one, so somebody seen it and they says, "Would well, you have the guys pose for that picture?" And he said, "Yeah." Thinking of the second picture, <laughs> never knew what he what he had. There. So he had taken the picture the first time, yeah, and, and that was the authentic picture. Right. And the other one was posed without any fire. Yeah. yeah. Well, the first picture, I said, uh, they took the flag down. See these kids, but he followed the uh, other people up on the second. So you never knew he took this in. Then he took another shot of all of them. And uh, when they asked him, did he post? They said, yeah, thinking it was the one, not thinking of the one that he never knew he had. That but, but you heard the cheer go up. Yeah. yeah. And, yeah. You, 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 and you saw it go. I was in a shell hole. Yeah. Waiting to him for him to go show. And I looked up on the left and there they are. And the flag went up. It was the second time. I didn't see it the first time. But how many guys were out there on the beach at that time? Oh my god, it was crowded. They had wrecked tractors. <laughs> and, and, uh, we'd bring the troops to shore. The first, we were in the first yeah. wave. We were supposed to take them out to the airport. We never got them. Yeah. Uh, come back almost. And boy, and all hell broke loose. And they had every square inch covered there. For the uh, artillery. Battle. Really? You mean after the flag, did that really galvanized everybody? Or? Oh, yeah. Hey, Jack. Yeah. Nice, nice talking with same you. Here. Where can I send this to you? Uh, 62 Oaks Avenue. Oh, oh Jack Colavito, C O L A V I T O, 62 Oaks Avenue, Riverhead, New York. 11901. You got it. All Thank right. You. Thank you, Jack. Thanks.